Minneapolis residents, listen up. You won't be able to cross the Stone Arch Bridge in about a month's time. Right, and repairs to one of the sides uh, that is set to begin soon. Hannah Flood joins us from the Live Center with uh, what you need to know about those repairs and how long they're going to last. Good morning. Yeah, that's right. This could impact Minneapolis residents. Anybody who goes and visits Minneapolis, we know the Stone Arch Bridge, super popular place for photo shoots, for visitors, all of that. Uh, MnDOT announces that part of that bridge will close on April 15th. That morning, crews will close the St. Anthony Main or the northeast side of the bridge to start repairing all of the stone and mortar work. Once that's done, crews will close the downtown side of the 140 year old bridge and reopen the other side. So people will still be able to walk to the middle of that bridge, but they'll have to turn around once they get there. And there are detours in place for people who need to cross the river. A pedestrian detour that is marked with the purple dash mark. Um, and then we're also showing a uh, cyan line and a yellow line that is showing the uh, bike detours. But in essence, the short end of it is that um, the Third Avenue Bridge will be the detour route for both pedestrians and bikers for this project. So you have the Third Avenue Bridge there and also the Hennepin Avenue Bridge if you do need to cross the river. Once the repairs are done on the St. Anthony side, work will start on the downtown side. The entire project is expected to take about two years, but again, Tom and Alex could be a big impact here, so we'll be sure to remind folks uh, uh, before April 15th of that closure. Yeah, yeah thanks mm -hmm. some people, and yeah. we're going to get it all spiffied again, though. Right? Yeah, it might Thank take a while, but it'll look pretty when yep. it's done. Thank you, Anna.